We understand how important mobility is for businesses. That's why at Aura Portal, we have created a new responsive form editor to work in perfect harmony with our instant workflow app. Now the forms can automatically adapt to any device, regardless of the resolution. Let's imagine a recruitment process which requires the approval of the department's manager. It's very likely that this manager spends long periods outside the office, so we will prepare a form that can be easily completed from a mobile device. To do this, we are going to use the Aura Portal Responsive Forms Editor. When we are ready to create a new responsive form, we have the option to use a wizard. This makes it easier for us to start building the form. We add a title and an image, and we can preview the results on the right. We can also modify the number of columns in the form and see how they will appear on other devices, although this can be modified for each device later. For now, we're going to leave it in three sections. We will use the second phase of the wizard to add some fields to the form. If we need another field that is not in the list, we can easily add it from the left panel. If we want to add, for example, a new decimal number field, we can click on that field type and then on New. Later, we can bring an active field from the process panel or create a completely new one. Let's start by entering three simple text type fields, employee name, current position, and new position. The form editor lets us select multiple fields to then drag and drop on the canvas. Once we exit the wizard, we can view the form in all available resolutions. Before creating new rows and entering more fields, let's add a background image. We have the option to repeat the image horizontally and vertically. We will continue by dragging a whole number field to input the years of experience, a date field to show the day the proposal was created, and a simple drop-down box to select the relevant department. We will also place the fields in order in the appropriate columns. We can use the third row to add some separation from the approval section. Here we will place a single column with an image, which we can add using a complement and its corresponding HTML editor. Finally, we will add a row with five columns, containing the following fields. Library type field to see the potential employee's curriculum. Score obtained in the selection phase. Approval selector, this will be an editable field. Start date and time, also editable. And a comment field that will cover the entire width of the screen. This layout is the one that we have configured by default for screens with high dimensions. For tablets and mobiles, we can change the column widths and even hide them if necessary. Once all the elements have been adjusted, we can preview the result for the different devices to check that everything is correct.